as you know molecular biology takes its roots mainly from the disciplines of genetics and biochemistry there were major discoveries which went in parallel in these fields and these discoveries led to the foundation of this new field molecular biology some important discoveries which led to the emergence of molecular biology as a discipline include in the field of biochemistry the synthesis of urea by frederick wohler in 1828 it laid the foundation of biochemistry and this important synthesis was followed by the discovery of first enzyme diastase which was discovered by anselm pan in 1833 parallel in the field of genetics the mendel's experiments which were performed by gregor mendel on garden pea in 1865 these experiments laid the foundation of genetics and after a long time in 1910 chromosomal theory of inheritance was proposed by t h morgan next was the discovery of dna by frederick mischer in 1869 it was an important discovery in the field of biochemistry and it was uh, followed by the discovery of cell free fermentation in 1897 by edward buckner he demonstrated that fermentation can be carried out in the absence of living yeast cells so he extracted some material from the yeast cells and he carried out fermentation in vitro after that the major important discovery was made by james b sumner who crystallized enzyme urease in 1926 on the other side in the field of genetics the next important discovery was made by barbara mcclintock and harriet crichton they provided physical evidence of recombination in 1931 next important contribution was made by george beadle and edward tatum in 1941 they proposed one gene one enzyme hypothesis next important contribution was made in the field of biochemistry by james watson and francis crick they discovered the double helical structure of dna in 1953 on the other side oswald avery and his colleagues they demonstrated that dna is the hereditary material they did their experiments and they proved it in 1944 this was further confirmed by alfred hershey and martha chase in 1952 so at this point the discoveries in the two fields led to the foundation of a new discipline called molecular biology although some scientists they are of the view that uh, the uh, discovery of double helical structure by francis and crick it was the foundation of molecular biology but actually it was the work in the field of biochemistry so in this picture you can clearly see that these two fields that is biochemistry and genetics they grew parallel and in addition uh, cell biology was also there so these three fields they merged and they make molecular biology so this was the foundation of molecular biology and a new field molecular biology emerged